Hello everyone. I hope you all are safe at your respective places. Well, there are a lot of issues to speak about, be it of the political issues, be it of the youth issues. But I think the present scenario speaks a lot about itself. And in Jammu and Kashmir, politics has been considerably affected by various factors. And the basic thing you have to think about is that whether there is an emancipation or the exploitation of the youth. The questions are how do we bring a good governance and are our current political systems well equipped uh, to bring about an ableist change in the society and how do our representatives are fair enough to speak for our fundamental rights. And why a sudden change in the society that youth wants an active participation in politics. Well, our already existing problems hai, like anti-youth policies, SRO 20, uh, 202, SRO 24, those 50,000 posts and uh, extra tolls, Jammu Kashmir bank result and 4G internet because it is a fundamental right and uh, students are demanding for it since 9 months because at this uh, global pandemic there is no other option left other than e-learning and 4G internet ki jage 2G internet mil raha lekin charges 4G ke hain aur aise illogical or irrelevant statements samne aati hain ki Jammu mein 4G internet hoga to Kashmir ke saath discrimination hoga so it is not right to say because people of Jammu always stood for their nation Jammu is always peaceful abhi already existing problems ke hamare paas koi solutions nahi hain ki hamare paas ek aur problem aa jati hai that is domicile certificate now my opinion about domicile certificate is that PR says state subjects should not be replaced with domicile certificate because state subject is our identity, state subject is our pride. It always reminds us of a respected Maharaja Hari Singh Ji who was so compassionate about its subject. So this may be dilution jo hai wo unacceptable. Hoga. Haan, jo log vardi hai ki citizenship ki, unko citizenship milni chahiye. Lekin, abhi itni jaldbazi kis chiz ki hai? Why are we in a hurry? Because at this pandemic situation uh, and besides uh, this pandemic situation the thing is that without the consent of common people of Jammu and Kashmir without the uh, stakeholders of Jammu and Kashmir is it right to do so that there is no forceful implementation of any thing that is unacceptable here is not right to decide 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 here and besides all this, unemployment is at its peak. So, itna jo logon ka ek saath influx hoga, kya ye yahan ke future generations ke liye, ya fir youth ke liye koi problem to nahi create karega. To is baare mein government ko zaroor sochna padega. Now, my message to all the youth out there is that we are the future of our beloved country, India. We are the future of our nation. To hume apna fate khud decide karna padega. We have to speak for our fundamental rights. This is not a time to to be silent. Uh, and at the end, I want to, to say out there that government has to think twice about it or government has to ready to face the consequences. And thank you so much. Jai Hind.